Are you freaking serious, bro? Hey, man, hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications. Bro, I'm so disgusted. I'm disgusted with this world. I'm just disgusted, period, bro. This is the worst thing I have ever seen somebody could. How can you honestly do this? This is the worst thing I have ever seen anybody do. But like I like I was just saying, I'm sorry. Like I was just saying, hit the like button, scratch on post notifications, follow your boy on IG. I don't know what y'all do. I can't even say that, bro. I'm so disgusted right now. Uh, my podcast channel in the description box below. Now I want y'all to watch this video right here. All right. I just want y'all to watch this. Watch the little video. All right. Look, just look at this. Here to have a great time and ride a couple of rides for a spring break here at Icon Park. He's from St. Louis, and you can see this makeshift. Now, if y'all don't know this story, this is the team that got killed on Orlando Ride. All right. This this is the team that got killed on Orlando, uh, Orlando Ride. Fell fell to his death. All right. Rest in peace, so. But uh, just... memorial in place, flowers, balloons, and teddy bears here, and his family beginning to arrive for that 6 p.m. silent make silent vigil. Here on spring break, I had just talked to him a couple hours right before that had happened. It's hard on us right now. A hurting family in search of answers. Shay Johnson is 14 year old Tyree Sampson's cousin and said his deadly fall from this free fall ride at Icon Park was tragic and could have been prevented. Take this down! Take this down! And that's why she appreciates the show of support she's seeing by even complete strangers, people wanting action. And she's even began this petition to try and make sure this doesn't happen to anyone else. It's not just me and my family that want that ride down. We got over 1,500 names just from yesterday. She says her cousin Tyree was here on spring break from then he said he went to the slingshot. They told him he was too big for that. But y'all did not let him get on those two, but y'all let him get on that one being overweighted. Now, as the investigation continues, Tyree's family wants people to see his big smile and know he had a bright personality. And he was a football player, all A's. Never got in no trouble. He was a good boy. This happening ahead of a 6 p.m. vigil in partnership with an Orlando-based... Okay, now, I'm gonna just stop it right there because I gotta say what I gotta say. Y'all probably looking at me like, bro, what's wrong with that video? <laughs> Let's scroll down just a little bit, okay? Tyree's mother told Florida authorities she doesn't know who Shay Johnson is, nor does anyone else in her family. Authorities have sent authorities have since confirmed that the woman's real name is Lo Loishina Brownie. I'm going to just call a dummy brownie, okay? Dummy brownie. A 32-year-old Orlando resident. In the week since the 14 year old's death, blah, 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 Brownie has spoken to Virgil, blah, 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 okay, blah, blah, blah. Brownie, Brownie has also given, uh, given multiple media interviews in which she expressed heartache over the tragedy and recalled the final conversation with the teen. Brownie told Outlets that shortly after she dropped Tyree off at the amusement park, girl, you don't even know him. He called her and claimed he had been denied entry to a couple of rides because of his size. All right. I mean, he was a big guy. The man was like right here. The man was 6'5 at 14, 340 pounds. That's crazy. Was eventually allowed to get to the free fall, a drop tower with a 287 pound uh, maximum weight limit, blah, blah, blah. Now, um, Deny family ties to the club. Okay, now this right here is crazy to me. Dog, how can you possibly lie and say you know a person because they did? And then, that's not even, that's not even the bad part, y'all. She made a GoFundMe page. Okay, she made a GoFundMe page. And you know, so many people just sending money because they feel bad. They're like, oh, why, why, why? They feel bad, this and that. She made a GoFundMe page. A GoFundMe page... And people sending money to her, and it's not even going towards the family. How can you do something so disgusting like this? This dude lost his life, and you want to sit there and say that you knew a person? You didn't even know the boy. You were saying that, saying that you knew this person, but yet you didn't know nothing about this person. You didn't know who this person was. You seen that his his death was rising up all over the internet, and now you want to fake like you actually know him. Like, oh, this is my cousin. He was a straight-A student. <laughs> Are you serious right now, bro? You is disgusting. You are disgust, bro. I, I just couldn't do that. 
I don't care how down bad I am in life. I don't care if I'm down to one dollar in my pocket. I could never, and I see somebody deaf goes up on the internet and is blowing up. I could never make a GoFundMe page for that person deaf. Say I know that person, knowing I don't know that person, and then make a GoFundMe page so people can send me money and it goes to my account and not that family. That is disgusting and that is selfish. Disgusting and selfish. They need to sue her, bro. They need to sue her. Get her out of here, coach. Get her out of here. I'm so sick in this world. Y'all are disgusting, bro. The fact that you could honestly think about doing something like this is just heartbreaking. It's a 14-year-old boy. Lost his life. <laughs> Man. I, anyways. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts on this, on this situation down below. Let me know y'all thoughts. What do y'all think about this situation? Is this... What, what do y'all think about this? How do y'all feel about the situation? I love y'all. I thank y'all for all that y'all do for me, Lord. I, I'm over here acting like I'm proud. I've been talking to God so much lately, y'all. I've been saying, Lord, like crazy. I'm over here talking like I've been praying so much, y'all. It's ridiculous. I'm a, look, I am officially a prayer warrior. Uh, but anyways, man, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, be a boy to pan. I love each and every one of y'all. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.